My name is Judy Coleman, and I'm part of the James Lab here at UCI. We're in the Department of Molecular Biology and Biochemistry. Today, I'm going to be dissecting Aedes aegypti mosquitoes, and we'll be dissecting um, the salivary gland in the midgut. We are interested in these specific tissues because they are very involved in the pathway of the virus and the parasites. When a mosquito ingests a blood meal, the parasite or virus goes into the salivary gland, and from the salivary gland, it goes into the midgut. It goes through the midgut epith epithelium and then into the hemolymph, and that travels through the mosquito's bloodstream, the hemolymph, and into the salivary gland. There it resides until it's ready to take another blood meal. All right, what I'm going to be doing now first is I'm going to be dissecting the midgut from the Aedes aegypti. First of all, I need to put on um, one times PBS. This is a buffer that is, is our good physiological conditions. So we put it on the slide. And I have a cold in order to keep the mosquito from flying away while we're dissecting. So that I will take the, um, for midgut, to get a midgut, I have to point the mosquito, I put the, my, um, I use a probe that I've made, and I put the probe through the thorax of the mosquito. Once I put it under the microscope, I pick up the forceps, I take the very end of the abdomen section, and I pull it off, and I leave the midgut behind. So the midgut's, the midgut's right there and I will pull that off.